So today we're going to make a concrete stool with one bag of rapid set, a five gallon bucket from Harbor, from Freight. Harbor Freight. Yeah, for free because we're loyalty members or whatever they are there. And then some chain. So stick around and find out how you can do it too. So the first thing we're going to do is determine how tall you want your stool. This one feels a little bit low. I'm going to go with 23 and a half inches. He likes to go with halves, quarters, whatever. Just round it to the hole. So we're also going to measure our other seat here. It looks like it's around two and a half inches. So let's make our concrete seat three inches. Well, now we're just going to cut our chain down into 36 inch lengths. We've got our chains cut. Now we're just going to weld them together. So put a ratchet strap on it to pull it taut and to make sure that our bar stool leg stays straight. We have our chain welded here. You can see it's just nice and straight. So let's throw it on the water and cool it off. So we were trying to determine the best way to get the chains to sit evenly in our bucket and yes we did change buckets because this one's got a smoother surface inside so we're going to tack all three together in the center and then we'll set them into the bucket so they'll all be even miss miss it's my first day welding y'all don't don't mind me We are zip tying the chain to the bucket. So this is gonna keep our chain in the lower third of the concrete. And it's also gonna keep the chain from being on the top of your seat. Okay, so we needed a few more zip ties to kinda get this going. But we've got these we're gonna weld after it's set up in the concrete. And that way we can get it nice and level and now we're going to spray down the bucket with some WD-40 just so the concrete will pull out a little bit easier. You ought to see how I use brake cleaner. So there's dump, a little bit of water in here. We're just using some leftover water bottles from the shop. And we're not going to be real scientific with this. Dump Get slow. the consistency we like. All right, we've got our concrete mixed up sufficiently. See there, it's just like a little bit soupy, not too bad. You don't want it too dry, not too wet either. You'll know when it's right. <laughs> now we're gonna take this sander and vibrate the bucket to... Oh, wow! Or we're not. We had a really bad sander. Uh, now we're gonna use the second one to vibrate the concrete. So now we're gonna let this sit for 24, 48 hours probably be sufficient. And we will be back with the results. All right, so we're gonna pull the seat out of the form now. So we actually only let this sit for, what, an two hour. hours? An hour or two, something like that. It's kind of nice. All right, so the concrete stool or plant holder, however you want to look at it, is kind of finished up here. And we've got all the chains welded and it's good and hard. 
Let's find out if it sits. Okay. I mean, it's a little wiggly, but I like it. Gives a little uh, spring in your teeth. It's a wiggle chair. That's what we're going to call it. The concrete wiggle stool.